place feels huge. I love it. My home. They did paint the door white and the fireplace white. But that's okay, because I, I, it kind of grew on me a little bit. I thought that I really, I really would like the blue, but now I'm, I'm glad it's all white. And then maybe my closet. And I have a nice rack on it. I was told my oven's broken. It's brand new, so they're gonna get me a, a new one. Wow. Wow. That's a nice light. Look at the shower. Water pressure check. It's good enough. Hey everyone, how are we doing today? As you can see, I am in my new apartment. I just got the keys like 30 minutes ago and we're here, we're doing it. So now we're going to start the actual moving vlog, what you have been waiting many, many parts for and what I have been waiting for months for to actually move into my brand new apartment. If you're new here, my name is Alexis. I am 24, I live in New York City. I am leaving my apartment in Uptown Manhattan where I live with three other roommates and I am moving downtown to a studio. So it's been a long journey. I think I started this series in November thinking that it was going to be a quick and easy process and it's now about two and a half months later. So if you're curious about my apartment journey and everything that has happened along the way, go check out my series, Moving in New York. This is the final part of it. So you missed about nine episodes before this, but if you don't have time to watch the entire series, then maybe just watch the episode before or the episode where I found this apartment. So you kind of know what's going on. So my apartment is totally renovated. When I first saw it, it was kind of in shambles, and now it looks so nice and beautiful. Like, come on, it's so cute. It's the perfect size for me. They built me this closet right here. This closet was not there when I saw it, and I was like, can I get a closet? And they were like, sure, and they built me one. I'm here with my boyfriend Jonah right now, and we are currently measuring and taping out where my furniture is going to go, because I need to order a lot of furniture. My movers are coming tomorrow, and I'm just making sure everything is going to fit. So, tomorrow's gonna be a little chaotic when everything is just like dropped on the floor in here. I'm probably gonna freak out a little bit because it's gonna seem like everything's not gonna fit, but it will. I just ordered a couch. I ordered a little kitchen table to go behind the couch. The table's gonna come on Saturday, two day shipping, and the couch is going to come next Friday. So I'm gonna have to go a week without the couch, but they were on sale and I had to order them before noon if I wanted them to come in time. That's what we just did. Now I think we're gonna go grab some food because we're really hungry, we haven't eaten yet, and then run to Target and get some cleaning supplies and other random things I might need for the apartment. Then after that, we're gonna go to Jonah's apartment where I've been storing a ton of stuff I've been buying over the past few weeks bring it all here. So we have a lot to do today. I can't believe it. We're here. We finally made it. I'm in the space and I'm so excited. It's a few hours later. We got some breakfast. Then we went to Target. Then we went to Jones' apartment. And then we're back here with all my stuff. In my last video, I already did a haul of some things I got from TJ Maxx like this trash can. Um, but then I just went to Target and I got a million cleaning supplies. Like, you know, glass cleaner and paper towels and slippers. I'm gonna do a light cleaning around the apartment before the neighbors come to make sure it's all clean. But honestly, because it was just newly renovated, it's pretty spotless. Like, it's not that dirty at all. What a great filming spot. Anyways. everything to the sides, make sure they're ready for tomorrow. And then I think we're gonna walk to Jonah's apartment. We're gonna make dinner, I'm gonna get some boba, and then we're gonna go back uptown to my old apartment and pack up the rest of my stuff. Woo! It's moving day. It's nine o'clock, I've been up for like two hours making sure all my stuff is ready. So here's all the furniture they're going to take. And the movers actually have been outside for like an hour. My moving time is between nine and 10. So I'm assuming since it's nine o'clock right now, they're gonna come up any minute because there they are right there. I probably won't vlog much of them taking the furniture out because it's gonna be absolute chaos. So, and my kitchen is disgusting right now. My roommates and I are going to come back next weekend and do like a deep clean of the apartment. So I'm gonna leave a ton of like random stuff here right now, but I'll be back. I'll be back to fix it. Um, 
So that's my update and the movers are gonna be here any second. Moving day! Alright, we've made it. We are here in the apartment and it was a good morning. The movers came and they moved everything out pretty quick and into my building pretty quick. So literally all my stuff is in the apartment, all the boxes. They put my bed back together, my dresser, my desk. And my super team this morning too got me a new oven. So that's fixed for the most part. One burner still doesn't work, but they're gonna figure that out. And one of my lights, I have track lighting in here. One of those don't work either, so they're figuring that out too, but no big deal. I'm not gonna sweat it. Now we just need to start unpacking things, but it's like one o'clock and Jonah and I are very hungry. So we're gonna go get some lunch and then come back and start working on things. I need to figure out how to turn my heat on. I'm freezing. It's not I didn't feel it. I'd rather be cold than hot, so honestly, it's fine. No? Is that how you turn it on? Whoa. That's loud. All right, well, that's my heat, if you hear that. I thought I was going to be super overwhelmed when we moved in. I thought my stuff was gonna take up like the entire place, but honestly, with my stuff in here, if the space feels bigger. I probably won't sleep here tonight because I need to wash my sheets that are at Jonah's apartment, so I'll probably just sleep at his place. And we're gonna spend the next three days putting this place together. I'm, I'm feeling great right now. I'm feeling very calm, very relaxed. some really heavy food and now I feel sick. Now we just have to start unpacking. So it's just me and Jonah. Right now we are going to unpack the kitchen. It also was really, really freezing in here. And I turned on the heat while we were gone and it got a little better. <coughs> bless you. Sorry. That's no, okay, bless you. Also, my bath mat I ordered and my paper towel under the cabinet thing came. <laughs> okay. It's 5.30 and we did the whole kitchen. Now we're kind of organizing the rest of the stuff in my room. <laughs> well, I guess my apartment, which is my room. I have some blankets and sheets I need to wash. So we're gonna go to Jonah's because he has laundry. Wash those, bring them back, and then maybe go get a drink. We're gonna keep organizing all the stuff because everything's just kind of like chaotically all over the place and we need to fix that. So it's only like 30 minutes later and total change of plans. I forgot that- talking to me, I was like, I know. No, no. I forgot that my friend Maggie was gonna stop by after work. So I was like, there's a reason why I wasn't gonna go do laundry earlier and I couldn't remember it. That's the reason. So I think what we're gonna do is she's gonna come over, we're doing things with my closet and dresser, then we'll go get a drink, and then we'll go to Jonah's, and then we'll do laundry in the morning. I think that's what we're gonna do. Saturday morning, I spent the night at Jonah's last night so I could do my laundry. I washed all my blankets, my new sheets, and my like thing I wrap my bed in. I, what is that even called? A mattress protector. A mattress protector. So we're gonna make my bed, put that together, and then we need to run uptown to go to my old apartment. I have to pick up a package for my roommate who's at work, and I have to get some games and curtains that I left behind, and then we're gonna come back down here, and then we're gonna go to Best Buy to get a TV, hopefully, today, and a microwave. The spending does not stop. So, that's what we're doing. 
it's a beautiful day. The sun, like look at that. The sun is coming in hot this morning. I am still very happy with my apartment and I'm really excited to buy some more things for it today. looks terrible. So we did the bedding. I'm not loving it, but it's growing on me. I got a cream comforter thinking it was gonna look more beige, but it looks more yellowish, but it matches the walls kind of. So I'm gonna let it, it's kind of wrinkly right now because I, I got it mailed to me. Now we're gonna go uptown, like I said earlier. It is 4.30, we went to my apartment, we came back, we came in here for a second, dropped off the stuff that we picked up, ran as fast as we could, got the bus, went to Best Buy, went to Target, because we forgot there was a Target across the street, that's better than the other Target we went to the other day. I got a ton of things. Target haul, I got this blanket. Thought it was cute. Let's go to the bathroom, I got a ton of nice bathroom things. This thing for my shower. It's a little close to that, but the water still runs, it's fine. These shower things I got on Amazon, but I got these hooks at Target. And then I got this bath mat because this one that I ordered was too small and too thick. So I'll just keep that right there. And then for the bathroom, I got this little tea tree and spearmint room spray. And I got this little candle. So I'm gonna put this on the little shelf that I'm gonna build later. And then we went to Best Buy. And I just got this big ass Samsung TV and I got a wall mount. So I think we are going to attempt to mount it right here. We just walked to Jonah's and back to get tools to mount the TV. So we're gonna take a break, eat a little snack and then get to building things. My table got delivered. We carried that up the stairs. If you're wondering, I decided to go with the 50 inch instead of the 55 inch. So not much of a difference, but I thought it's already pretty big in the first place, so I'll be okay. Trying the TV for the first time. Let's see if it works. We got it up. We're setting up the Wi-Fi right now because the TV won't let us connect until the Wi-Fi is set up. We're waiting for our Thai food. All right, we're gonna do this. Set up the Wi-Fi, the Wi-Fi works. We're eating our Thai food on this container and now we're setting up the TV. So everything's good and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Good morning! Surprise, we built this table last night and I didn't even tell you about it. It was really late and we got our second wind after eating our Thai food. And now we're building this shelf thing that I bought at Ikea for my bathroom. We got coffee and acai bowls this morning and then we realized that my Wi-Fi didn't really work. The TV had like super, can they not? <laughs> what is going on? Chad. I'm gonna get a full length mirror too, but I had this mirror at my other apartment, if you remember, and it was tilted the other way. It was horizontal instead of vertical, but it fits so nicely in the space like this. Look at that. Beautiful. So here we are um, in the apartment. We've actually gotten a lot of stuff put away. It's still a little messy back here on the table and everything, but we put these boxes here to kind of symbolize where the couch will be so I can start having like a normal walking pattern instead of just walking right through the middle of the floor. We have a ton of stuff up here. I did some storage. It's just like my suitcases and my big box for my monitor for my job. All right, so we're entering the bathroom and here I am in my nice mirror with the nice lighting. I hung the towel here because at Ikea they have these like command strip things, but they're like fancy looking. I could have put it here, but I didn't want to obstruct my view in this beautiful mirror. I still need to get something to hold the toilet paper, but here's my favorite part of the bathroom. Look how nice this looks. So I put extra towels down here, extra toilet paper right here. I put a little washcloth and hand towel here, a little candle and room spray, 
a plant that my neighbor gave me. And then I think I'm gonna put my makeup here, but I wanna get like a nice box to put it in that like makes it look all clean. Then I have the green shower curtain, which I think I already showed you. Hung my towels on the back of the door. And honestly, I did this on accident, but my two soaps I have right now are both also green. We're doing such a green theme right now. I love it. I love my bathroom. I don't know why I've been obsessing about my bathroom. That's been like my biggest thing. I have no idea how I'm gonna decorate my entire rest of my apartment, but at least I have my bathroom. I just went and saw my friend in her off-Broadway show and I just took the subway and walked back to my apartment and now I am in my apartment alone for like pretty much the first time. Jonah's been here all weekend helping me with things and helping me get things ready and part of me started to kind of act like it was our space even though it's definitely not, it's just my space. I was relying on him for a lot of things, which isn't crazy because I mean he's like strong and tall and was able to like help me build a lot of things that I probably wouldn't have been able to do myself. I gotta go to Trader Joe's in the morning because I still haven't gone grocery shopping, so I gotta pick up some food. If you're still watching this vlog, thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't yet, please subscribe to my channel, give this video a thumbs up, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye!